initial responses when you two found out that you would be the leads of your own show? Mina, can we start with you? <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's such a blessing. It was so exciting. It was um, thrilling to know that um, I get to continue to be Fennec Shand and I get to work alongside Tim and John and Dave and Robert. Um, these are all just incredible gifts. Um, I, I don't know. It, it, it's still a little, little bit of, uh, of a surreal experience for me that um, I'm an ongoing character that uh, is in this uh, incredible Star Wars universe. And I'm, I'm very grateful. Yeah, it's just way cool for us, uh, way cool for us both to just uh, going on that journey. And I, I wanted to make sure I did a good job in that reveal of when I was in the Mandalorian. So in the hope that things like this will happen. So, uh, it's just very, very exciting that uh, it did happen the way it sort of panned out and uh, the fans enjoyed it so much so. So uh, it gave everybody confidence to uh, to put us in this position. So it uh, just feels fantastic, I guess. Yay, I can feed my kids. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, it all worked out. And yeah. I would be rem remiss if I didn't talk about the fact that this is a Star Wars production that stars both Pacific Islander and Asian American actors as the leads, which has never happened before. No. What goes through your minds when you two thinking about that? Timur, can we start with you? Uh, I just think it's, uh, again, it's when, when I went to work, I, uh, I put the name of one of my uh, Maori ancestors on my name, on my chair and my name of my uh, car park and the name of my changing room. So that gave me a sense of representing my indigenous people. So I wanted to do well, which put pressure on me. Hey, don't, don't muck this up, boy. You know, uh, mm -hmm. do your best every day. And um, because of those things, because very rarely we get the opportunity, you know, as a, uh, to be seen in this way. So, uh, and as lead. So, uh, so, you know, we're representing in a way and we, we have a, that kind of responsibility to, uh, to do the best we can. And, yeah. uh, you know, we have young yeah. people looking up to us and it sort of broadens their horizons too. So, uh, so I hope that it happens to, you know, if they can look at us and say, well, they did it. I better right. get off my bum and do something with my life too and get out there. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's, you know, it's one of those things that you never take for granted. And, you know, having this longevity of a career as an Asian woman and now an Asian woman of a certain age, it's supposed to be one of those things where, I'm, I should be put out to pasture. I shouldn't have gotten these opportunities. And the fact that uh, this opportunity exists and is here and uh, we're both thriving and being uh, looked up to, it's, it's all just amazing perks. And I certainly don't take it for granted. You know, I feel like there's a big, strong responsibility to represent in the most positive and the most um, inspiring way possible. And yet at the same time to do our jobs as actors, which is to just tell good stories, you know, based on what's written and what we can bring to these characters. Indeed. Um, unfortunately, that's all the time I have. Um, thank you both so much for your time and congratulations on the show. Thank you so much. Thank you, Lauren. Great backdrop there. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Fanboys, professional artists, and professors. Maybe a nerd who's just like you, talking about the things that you like too. So I invite you to the NOC. In full color, you see me. The hard not lying. Comics, movies, and TV. Yeah. Pop culture with a different perspective. Watch it on your screen. Hit play. So check this.